PUBG at one point had a chance to be a top 10 shooter game in terms of popularity, that opportunity is now long gone. Adding a new map is not going to save this game. When you have a company in Blue Balls Entertainment that has completely ignored their fan base and has deleted posts, deleted comments by fans or players, and they fail to listen to what is being said on those websites or even on Xbox Live, whether it's on the PUBG Club or the actual reviews for the game, ignoring players means only bad things are going to happen. The amount of rendering, the glitches, the game crashing black screens, the crazy amount of lag that happens when you get near somebody, and above all that, mouse and keyboard players on console have made this game damn near unplayable on Xbox and PlayStation. And most of the things I just mentioned are still happening occasionally, and the game has been fully released on Xbox. It's not in game preview anymore. Oh, but thank God it's eSports ready, right? What a joke. What a joke. And let me holler at my PC players real quick. You guys have no clue how lucky you are. Us console players, we have to deal with 10 times the amount of bullshit that you have had to put up with. Which is hard to imagine, I know. I remember watching a video a while back where a PC player was complaining and whining that console players get handed everything and the better versions of any game made that is on both PC and console. Let me tell you something. That guy must have never played on console before, especially console PUBG, man. I mean, the aiming on this game with a controller is horrible. The looting system takes forever with a controller, versus somebody with a mouse and keyboard can basically loot an entire box and get everything they want in about 5 seconds. And some people are even faster than that with a mouse. Bottom line, PUBG, as far as looting and aiming, was not designed for a console. And that leads to having teammates that don't know how to play or aim. And they just point fingers at each other, blaming everything on everybody else when shit goes south. On top of all the things I mentioned with lag, black screens, or the game crashing, I mean it just ruined it for me. I liked winning on this game, but with all the issues in the game itself, and trash teammates that don't know how to play, it's just damn near impossible to have a good time playing this game on console, no matter how many kills or wins you get. It's the truth. And the player count shows that on Xbox. I can't even find a first person match anymore at night. And that's a shame. This game had such potential, it's really a shame that the console version is this bad. You know, I believe no matter what it is you're doing in life, you should always strive to do a better job on whatever it is you're working on, or whatever your craft is. And I just don't see that from Blue Balls Entertainment on this game. They just want the money. And that, unfortunately, is becoming more common among these big gaming companies today, like EA, like Activision, DICE, you name it. They don't care. It's just about the money. They don't believe in making good products anymore or giving back to the fans or players. I mean, I tried with PUBG, but when you have so many issues with a game and a company that doesn't want to make a serious effort towards the console version and only cares about the color green, it's hard to play it. I play it once in a while because it is actually fun playing squads with a few people that can hold their own that don't point fingers and just want to have a good time. Because at the end of the day, that's what it's all about, having a good time with your buddies. But like I said, with all the issues, when it's all said and done, I can't ever recommend buying the console version of this game to anyone. And in my opinion, this might just be the worst version of a game that went from PC to console. And that's all I have for today. Hashtag FixPubG in the comments section below. Have a great day and I'll catch you next time. Peace. Oh, through the what? Come out, dude. Oh. I'm, I'm pretty sure I just got shot through a wall. Are you, are you gonna... Oh my god.
Yeah, I got shot through a wall.